woke up this morning to screaming. So there's a laser in there and it's just warming things up. So it loosens yeah. up. I might even film him popping her neck. It's no. like the scariest thing I've ever seen. No. Good morning, Toa Squad. This is starting differently. At the request of mom, not me, because she wants to know where this is going to go. And remember this. Woke up this morning screaming on the pillow next to me because somebody's neck can't move. And I've had these, and typically I just kind of go, kink, and it is excruciating, and then I'm better. But that's not happening here. And so I'm starting to film this so that Madam here can see how this looks later. You doing okay? It doesn't look so good. <laughs> it looks wonderful. We made a massage therapist appointment. I got our chiropractor to hustle his buns, and we are leaving here in 15 minutes to go to the chiropractor, but it might take us 15 minutes just to walk to the car. We'll fill you guys in. You'll get to see this process. I might even film him popping her neck. It's no. like the scariest thing I've ever seen. Oh, it sounds horrible. Comment down below if you've been to a chiro chiropractor and if they scare you or if you love them. So, you saw a bit of that. Now I'm grabbing shoes real fast. I've got her car warming up. Let's get this lady to the chiropractor. All right, so she can't come into the garage. There's too many stairs. That was very crazy. Yeah, I'll try not to film a lot of the scary stuff, but you got a little taste of that. And that has been going on since about 5.30, 6 o'clock this morning, and now it's 9.30. So, all right, let's go get ready. You made it. Worrisome. Yep. This is called walking gingerly. We couldn't get into the front seat, so we're getting in the back seat. I am very interested to know if a chiropractor can fix this. I really, really, really hope he can. He helped Clay with her hips. A while ago because clay she taught herself how to do the splits but she would rotate her hips weird when she did them so he finally went and helped her out with that so we'll see mom i what do you think you think you'll fix it I'm really scared it's really hard to slow down and speed up in a way that doesn't make her neck jolt back and forth or go side to side so i'm trying to miss like sewer cap lids i'm trying to miss potholes all right so we're here and there's a lot of stairs. So I called a uh, trophy place and I'm having them make a thing about her climbing Mount Everest because that's what she's about to do. All right. The Cliffs of Insanity. Whoa, you're doing really good. I have a hand for you, do you want it? Or are you doing good holding yourself? Because I would move her too quickly, or too slowly, or push, or lean back. And she's just keeping everything straight. <sighs> it's intense. What did you call it? Torticollis? Yeah. Wow. I'd say seven-ish. Collis is neck. Yeah. Tortus, tort, torsion, right. twisted neck. Yeah. Like contortion. You torqued, you torqued your neck. So they're gonna laser and reach his neck, muscles and tendons first, get them all loosened up and warmed up, and then he's gonna try to... So there's a laser in there and it's just warming things up? So it loosens yeah. up or? Yeah, so it's called a cold laser, but it's warm, it feels warm. And then it um, goes in and it breaks up inflammation. So doing this one time is as good as if you iced twice a day for five days. Wow. So I couldn't film that. It was crazy, the popping and the charring and in a good way though. And she feels... He said her muscles are so tense that so we have to come back in tomorrow and he's gonna do it one more time. And she had, what was it, two ribs that were out of place? Yeah. And so right next to her spine, two ribs are out of place. He popped the one side and he popped the other side and all of a sudden she went, okay, that's better. 
I should get move a little bit more. We are back in the car. So I'm gonna do a nice, soft, smooth ride home. And then we're gonna pamper this lady. And then we have to come back tomorrow for one more adjustment. Good morning. Jace helped me get dressed. And then he left to take Shay for his special day. It's Shay's birthday, yay! Still really, really sore. Like I feel like my muscles are sore today than they were yesterday. Uh, I go for a massage and I get another adjustment. Evie made awesome breakfast, Evie. Good job, Evie. Cora's loving the pancakes. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. I gotta get in the car for my massage. Here he goes laughing at me. <laughs> Raquel, get my leg in the door. It's stuck. Oh. Moms get broken sometimes. Okay. Raquel is my chauffeur today. She'll be taking me around. Ooh. Just got out of the massage. Makes me look like the creases from the bed are on me. That's crazy. I feel so much better. I can't move completely as good as normal, but I am on the mend. All right, you guys, it's been a couple days. Rach spent a couple days on the couch because the bed has been way too hard. But last night, she actually slept. She slept so well that she took up the whole bed. It's actually time. She has an early morning appointment with the chiropractor this morning. So we can do one more adjustment. She's getting a teeny bit better. You sleep in a little bit. It's time for the appointment. I brought it to your level so you didn't have to raise your neck. What's your mobility like? It's it's, it's better. Can you stand up without crying? I can. I think I can. Without my hand? <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Superwoman has emerged. What's Supermom? She can stand up. All right, so how are you doing now? I'm getting better. I can turn. I can do stuff. But sharp movements hurt a lot. But yeah. Oh, they're so tense, they can't do anything. They're still pretty tight in here? Yeah. Oh, that always scares me. All right, we're back in the car. Mom got adjusted. <laughs> oh my gosh. She's got one more massage left, but I think and let's- another adjustment, and probably more adjustments. I feel like I'm on the mend, but I'm exhausted. Like, I have to sit down. Awesome. We probably need to watch movies the rest of the day. I really want to. Good plan. Good plan. So I'm going to research a few things. There's some people that think that there's a virus that you can catch in those muscles that causes that to kink. There's stress. There's lots of things. We need to do some preventative measures now so we can make sure this doesn't happen again. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you next time. Bye.